South Korea has officially inducted its newest stealth warship, ROKS Gyeongbuk, FFG-829, into naval service at the SK Ocean Plant Shipyard. This marks the commissioning of the second Ulsan-class frigate in the FFX Batch 3 line, built entirely with domestically developed systems and sensors. According to an announcement from the Republic of Korea Navy via its official Facebook page, the ROKS Gyeongbuk follows the earlier launch of ROKS Chungnam, the first ship of this upgraded frigate class. These vessels represent a significant step in South Korea's multi-phase plan to phase out aging corvettes and frigates and introduce a more modern, capable surface fleet. Commissioned under a defense contract signed in late 2021, the Gyeongbuk boasts an array of cutting-edge capabilities. It is outfitted with a fixed four-panel multifunction radar array, infrared search and track (RST) equipment, and all-weather sensors, all integrated into a stealth-designed sensor mast. Notably, all these systems are of South Korean origin, reflecting the country's emphasis on defense technology independence. At 129 meters in length and nearly 15 meters in width, the ship features a displacement of 3,600 tons. Its armaments include a 16-cell Korean vertical launching system, KVLS, a 127mm MK.45 naval gun, and the indigenous KSAM missile platform for anti-air defense. A key innovation on board is the incorporation of LIG NEX-1 CIWS-2, an advanced close-in weapon system tailored for short-range aerial threats. The Chungnam class is the first in the Republic of Korea Navy to be fitted with this defensive weapon, showcasing a major technological evolution in South Korea's naval warfare capabilities. The launch of this frigate series also plays a critical role in trialing next-generation naval technologies. The Batch 3 Ulsan class ships serve as testing platforms for integrated combat systems, such as the Stealth Mast and the new CIWS-2, which are expected to become standard in future South Korean warships. The previous vessel of the class, ROKS Chungnam, entered service in April 2023. With Gyeongbuk now following suit, the Republic of Korea Navy continues to reinforce its surface fleet with sophisticated, homegrown designs, bolstering its maritime defense in an increasingly contested regional environment.